Looking right at me. How are you doing? Good. You feeling all right? Yeah. You're two time medalist. How's that feel? It feels good. Yeah. Yeah, I, I wanted gold more, two time gold medalist, but this will have to do for now. It'll have to do. I think you'll settle, because I got to tell you something, there aren't many of them. Okay, you should be really proud of yourself. You did go out there and you put the wood to her pretty quick, taking oh, a couple of eggs, and scored some points early. What was the thought process there? Were you, were you trying to jump out to a beat and you want to feel her out at all? Uh, mostly, I'm not going to lie, anger from losing. Uh, uh, anything, anything that put pain, I was going to do. So if it was getting it done early, then it was getting it done early. Yeah, you put your head right through her face there the first one, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, you did. Um, she did start to kind of climb back a little bit into the hand fight. Um, did you feel her start to wither towards the end? Uh, I mean, I didn't really too much think about what she was doing in the moment. It was just go, go, go put my foot on the gas, do what I do. Because honestly, it was like, uh, I, I really got away from that sem semifinals. So it was like getting back on track and uh, doing what I needed to do. So I didn't really feel what she was doing, but I know that she was definitely hand fighting. And that hand fight led to a pancake and the pancake led to a pin. Yeah, it did. Hey, so what did you learn from that semifinal loss against Japan? Uh, no, everybody's beatable. Um, I came here last year, I took gold. I came here this year, uh, head high, thinking I'm gonna win it. It didn't happen this year. Uh, so definitely prepare myself mentally and physically because it's definitely been a roller coaster these past two weeks. So definitely prepare myself for, for what I want. I get what I deserve, so the third place is what I deserve.